So this game just popped up on the radar a couple days ago. It is called Soul Mask. I am excited to check this one out. Soul Mask is a giant sandbox survival game. Right now, there's only online games. You can't do single player just yet, but we're going to go ahead and jump into a little bit of online action, kind of see what is what with the gameplay here. Excited for this one because it's an open world survival and you can recruit your own tribe and then take that tribe to war with you. So it's really cool. We're excited to see what's in this one. Uh, looks like we're just now getting to the demo, so there's not a lot of players on right now. I'm excited to see where this game goes, though. Hopefully they keep building it up. It is supposed to have individual server support and single player when the actual game comes, but this is just the demo available over on the Steam store right now. So let's go ahead and check this out. We've got Americas. I like it. Uh, PvE, because we don't do PvP. Let's join. Boom. I don't do a lot of online gameplay, so this will be kind of fun to check this out, but it's listed as both single player and an MMO, but you can have your own private servers. Right now, PC only from what I understand. I don't know if they have any eventual ideas to go to console or anything, but let's see what this game has to offer. Let's check out the character creation. Pretty basic. Remember, this is very, very early on, but from what I've heard, the building in this game is epic. All right, we got our guys set up, so looking pretty good, big and strong, ready to go. Oh, we get to design our mask, too. Nice. Well, obviously, we go with a little bit of blue. And... Even more blue. Oh, we got a couple different styles here. That one looks a little weird. I, I kind of like that one the best for, like, the actual look. Let's see what it looks like. Blue and blue. All right. I think that blue with that blue. There you go. Name... TBF and create. Let's check this out. All right, here we go. And of course, my luck, we spawn in while it is raining and a little bit dark. Let's go ahead and see what we got here. L is to hide guidance, harvest grasses. Is it E? It is E. There we go. Get a little bit of XP for that. Pick up stones and branches on the ground. We'll look for those in just a second. We're we doing like sticks. There you go. Uh, some more plant leaves. Here we go. That's a pretty big stone. I assume we can't grab that. Okay. I don't know if there's a specific direction we need to be going. I don't know if this is like a giant online map. Let's hit the M button here. Oh, here we go. We've got a bunch of question marks all over the place. This map looks massive. Wow. Oh, it is huge. Wow. Okay, so the map is giant. That's awesome. All right, let's do some search and see what we can find. We need to get stones and branches still. So look for look out for stones. There you go. There's our first branches. Pretty easy to find. Get some of those. Got our first stones. All right, bonfire. Press T to enter mask repair view. Oh wow. Okay, mask node repair, knowledge and technology. Oh wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, so emergency storage, deter, grants deterrence ability when repaired. Okay, this one is memory unit harvest, and this is falling buffer. Okay, under the knowledge, we've got basic building, primitive tools. Oh wow, dawn of the new tribe, advancement of bronze, glow of iron. Nice, so it goes all the way up through the bronze, all the way up to the steel age, up to the deep in ruins. Very cool. All right, rise of the barbarians. Press and hold the bonfire on the right to unlock. So let's go over here and look for bonfire. Do we see a bonfire? I don't see it. There you go. So we click on that, rise of the barbarians, bonfire, click and hold. We've learned bonfire. Okay. Now we need primitive tools. So let's go back there. We need primitive tools. And I didn't see which one to get. We need tools and stone tools. So knowledge, primitive tool. So there's a bunch of stone tools. Are we learning all of those? There we go. Up on the... Like we can learn all of those. So those ones need zero tech points, so we can learn these without any issues. Okay. All right. Cool. 
Looks like it's the same with those. We don't need any points for that. Okay. Press tab to enter the crafting bar. Here's our crafting bar. And then we need to craft any of the four stone tools. Let's go ahead and check out which ones we need here. I need flint and stone for that one. This one we need branch, five flint, five stone. Oh, interesting. Looks like there's someone logged out right here. What's up? Very cool. Builder Osihi. All right, we have a pickaxe, so we can do that now. Mine quest. It is about to be nighttime, so what I'll probably do is log off the server and then come back in, hopefully during the daytime. We just have to kind of figure out how fast night and day are. Chopping down a tree. Oh, he hits much harder than I do. Okay, we can climb. That's really good. <laughs> we almost died to a little pig. All right, we need to go to knowledge and technology, basic building. Basic building, boom. Let's go ahead and do a thatch foundation, thatch wall, thatch cover, thatch door. We would get our first base built up. That'd be amazing. Furniture, thatch frame. Is that it? Next one is press tab to enter the crafting and craft a thick rope. Thick rope. Okay. Okay. Can we do a couple more? I don't know how many we need. We'll make a couple of those. Use a primitive weapon once. Learn how to craft primitive weapons from the mask tech. All right. Let's go back to the mask tech. Knowledge and technology. We already did the basic weapons. So now let's see if we can make them. We need to make a wooden bow. Let's make a wooden bow or a spear. We can make a spear. I can make a bow. And we can make arrows. There you go. That's three times five, four times five. There you go. Four stacks of five, so that'll give me 20 to start with right away. So there we go. We have our first spear, wooden spear, and first bow coming up. And then we need to use it, but I'm actually afraid to shoot these guys because knowing my luck, they'll kill us. But we kind of have to try it. I think I completely missed. Let's try again. I think I missed again. Can I not hit him in water? I might just be really bad at shooting. Let's try this again. There might be like a really bad drop on the arrow maybe. Because we're so bad at it. I don't even think I have the arrows equipped yet. There we go. I was shooting nothing. Oh. That's a level 9. Hold on. Stop aiming your bow. Run. Okay, I think they ran away, so they were even more scared. All right, let's build a thatch foundation. Let's get a foundation built up. So, foundations. Thatch foundation. We need at least a couple of those. I can't make very many, so we probably need to chop down some more trees and get some more equipment here. So let me work a little bit on that. Build a thatch foundation and place part once. All right. It looks like everything we do in this game is leveling something up, which is absolutely awesome. I love games like that. The old MMO lover in me definitely enjoys that. All right, let's go one more. How many do I have? Where do they go? There they are. So they're actually on the nine slot. Okay. Cannot build in water. Here we go. Boom. There we go. There's our first one. Oh, and they take up one slot for each one. Oh, what did I make there? Hold on, what did I make? Thatch basket. <laughs> I wasn't going for that, but okay. I need more thatch foundations. We need more thick rope. Okay, so if we make more thick rope. How do I... There you go. Make a bunch of thick ropes. And then make a bunch more thatch foundations. Two. There you go. Four total? Nope. All right, four total... Hopefully those fill up one. Okay. Let me see when it actually does the second one here. Hopefully it stacks. Because if it doesn't stack, that's going to be insane. There we go. Yep, it stacks. Okay, cool. Get that one. We'll get that one. We'll get one more. And then we'll have our first little 2 by 2 foundation. The building in this is really smooth, too. It feels clean. Yeah, super simple. Works well. Let's get some thatch walls. One, two, three. I can make two. What are we missing? More rope. We need tons of this rope. Let me see. Where's that rope at? Rope is... Oh, it's just vines. We can go crazy making that. All right. 
There you go. I can make a giant stack of thick ropes. All right. Walls. Oh, the building in this is super smooth. Okay. Yeah, the building in this really smooth. Two. There you go. Five total. One, two, three, four, five, six. Give or take. How do we do a doorway? Is it a separate building piece? It is. Okay. And then ceiling, or is it just the flooring? Probably that one. One. I can't do it yet. Okay. Wait for that one to finish. Let's go ahead and put these down. I'll put a door there. All right. We definitely made a mistake by building on the grass right there, but that's fine. We'll deal with that later. Another door here. Right. Another wall here. And then this last one coming up. Oh, my bad. You know what? Actually, that's fine because now we can go like this. How do I get rid of these? Dismantle. Okay, and we get some of that back. Very nice. Okay, number nine. Boom, we have our first door. There you go, man. Looking good. All right, master linen processing in Mastech. Linen processing. Is that... Oh, it's tech. Linen processing. Linen gear? I don't know if that's what it means. Oh, no. Linen processing. Basic slaughtering, carpentry, tannery. I don't see it, actually. That's the only one that I see lin. Linen. Okay, master linen processing. It's here somewhere. All right, we got to make linen once. Let's do that. I think we actually need a couple in order to make the clothes that we need to do. And then linen gear. Let's go ahead and check out linen gear. So for that, we need pieces of linen and thick ropes. So let's go crazy with linen. We can actually make a bunch of it. All right, and then we need probably a few more. And then we need to do some more rope. Some more of the thick rope. Same with this one. Pump that up. Okay. Once that's done, we'll make a little bit of linen, and then we'll finally be clothed and not be out here naked and afraid. Linen costume. Linen pants. Perfect. And then once that rope is done, linen shoes. And last one, linen gloves. So there you go. We'll have linen clothes. This will be perfect. All right. Does it auto-equip, or do I need to equip it? Looks like we've got to equip it. We got that. Got our first shirt. Got our pants. Got our shoes. Uh, we didn't get gloves. Did I make two pairs of shoes? Oh, I did. Oh, look at that. They actually get better as you work on them, though. How cool is that? All right. Uh, gloves. Linen gloves. I forgot you. Okay. So can I... I don't know if I can do anything with them. Let's go gloves boom there you go man we're all dressed up nice what's next successfully hunt any common wild animal in the rainforest all right oh man we can finally see now too look how beautiful this game is it's finally daytime finally beautiful out i probably should have waited till daytime to get recording but we wanted to make sure we got something out today oh god he saw us they've all they've all saw us <laughs> hunting down the wild turkey oh we hit him okay got him we actually got him wow dissect the animal carcass with the butcher's knife okay I've got the little knife here uh, turkey hunting score oh oh that's cool okay I don't know if I actually have the butcher's knife yeah I do okay I assume we just do it like that. <laughs> there we go. Okay, cool. We got it. Oh, this is so cool. This game is beautiful, man. They did a great job on this early on. Let me see what we got next. Craft plank or a handle on the carpenter's table. I really want to get through some of this early progression. I would love to go exploring, but it's probably a good idea to not go out too far. I like our little water spot here, too. Oh, look, little baby animals. Look at the little babies. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a little baby baby turkey. Interesting.
There you go. He takes pretty good damage with the arrow. Let's do that. Can we get our arrows back? I don't actually know. It doesn't look like it, but I'm not sure. Oh, baby turkey is not a thing? Maybe not. Okay, I might just be missing it, but that's fine. We also found last night that this is clay, so we got a bunch of clay last night as well. Where's my door? So we need to craft a plank or handle on the carpenter's table. Do I have the carpenter table unlocked? I do. For that one, we need two more thick ropes. And interesting. Logs or hardwood. Interesting. So let's make a couple ropes. I don't know if that means it has like alternate crafting recipes. There you go. All right, carpenter's bench. Okay, we need some more logs. Let's do some chopping down of some trees. All right, carpenter's table coming up. That one takes two minutes to craft, so that one's gonna take a while. That's not too bad though. Uh, I don't know if we can pick up and move our campfire. This is a cool little spot though. What else do we have? Stone pickaxe, stone pickaxe. So it looks like we do have multiple of those. It's pretty cool though that your everything improves as you go. So we'll, we'll continue to improve all those. Our actual character, you can see we are level 10 already. Perception, physique, strength, endurance, agility. Oh wow. This shows all your proficiency stuff. Logging, we're already up to 10. Wooden stone, 10. So on down the line. Max level right now in the demo, I believe is 30, but I'm not 100% sure. Mastery, so if we... This just happens as we go. Uh, so as you reach certain levels, there's a chance to learn new skills. So for like archery, dodge barrage, back jump shot. Very cool. So no matter which route you go. So the one we played earlier today in Shrouded, definitely more magical. This one a little more grounded. I mean, grounded-ish <laughs> when it comes to having like a, you know, a giant mask that gives us some kind of power or something. All right. Uh, let's go eight. Boom. See if we can. That thing has a lot of health, man. Dang. A capybara, that's what that is. We've eaten you in the forest. No, in Green Hell. Green Hell, we definitely ate that guy. All right. How close are we getting with this? Getting really close. Let's move. Actually, let's put that down. Zero. Put this over here. I think this is an actual storage, right? Yeah, there we go. We can store some things over here. Especially the ones that we've made multiple of. We can go cook our meat over here. Right, like so. And... There you go. Is it crafting? Can't tell. Oh, cooked meat. There you go. Do as much as you can. Eight. Okay, let's grab a little bit of cooked meat. I'm going to see what kind of, if it gives us any bonuses or anything when we do it. A lot of hotkeys. Grant all, withdraw all. Okay. Let's do that. And then go like that. And nine. There we go. And it looks like the carpenter bench is ready, so let's throw that bad boy down. The building in this game, they nailed it, though. I'm, I really like the building in this game. Uh, okay. Needs to be kind of in the middle. There we go. Oh, it's actually... It, Extends out a little more than I thought. Okay. Carpenter's table. So on this one, we need to make a plank. Insufficient materials. Oh, do I need to have the stuff over there? Plank is just logs. Uh, hmm. What am I doing wrong? No tribesman is guarding this crafting table. Appoint a caregiver. Interesting. Okay. Craft a plank. What am I doing wrong? log. Oh, that's hardwood. It's not the right one. Okay, I guess we need to go get more wood. There you go. Obtain log times four. That's what we needed. Go ahead and put that on here. So log times four. Now we can do a plank and or a handle. There you go. Both those getting made up. It looks like he actually does a little bit of action when he does that. That's awesome. Okay. What now? 
Use a stone weapon once. Okay. I just need to go poke this guy. All right, poke the capybara. Is that not a stone weapon? Stone. I thought that was a stone. Maybe a stone lance? I'm not sure. Oh, one of these. One of the the bigger stone weapons. Okay, we can try that. Hold on, stone weapon. Maybe we make it... We get these out. Okay, now. Stone... There's like this giant hammer, throwing knife, throwing axe, stone lance. Maybe that's it? There you go. Okay, so that's being made on my inventory. There's a stone hammer. Is that a weapon? That is a, that's a weapon too. So we'll get the lance and the hammer made up. Maybe one of those will be what we need. There you go. We're starting to get a lot of weapons. Check out all these weapons. So this is a... Oh, no. We'll be back. No, not draw water. I need my... Okay, we might have got rid of it forever. Let's use this. Oh, nice. Okay, you can run around with a giant, gigantic hammer. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Very cool. Consume any cooked meat. We actually just made some of that. Let's grab some more. We're rolling through these missions, at least, getting quite a bit done, so we can kind of figure out what's up with the game. If we play this again, we'll definitely get into some more stuff just on our own. Move that down there. Eat a piece of that. Use water bottle once to quench thirst. Take water from water source if the water bottle is empty. Okay, how do I make a water bottle? Water bottle. This is... We need fiber and thick rope. And then I think we need some kind of hidden for it, though. Water. There's a water bucket. Well, let's check this. Insufficient materials. So we need either beast hide or deer skin. So I guess we got to go hunting. So it's time to do just a little bit of exploration. How much time do we have today? We can go just a little bit further. I don't want to get too much done in this one. If you guys want to see more of this, you guys want to see more of Soul Mask, let me know. We're kind of trying out a lot of new games on the channel, see what kind of sticks, what doesn't. I'm really doing it more for fun, so if it doesn't get the views, it's not the big it's not a big deal. I don't really mind that so much, but hopefully you guys are at least enjoying it. For those that do watch it, I really do appreciate it. It's been a lot of fun getting into some new games, checking out some new stuff, especially something new like this, Soul Mask, that I've never even seen before. Excited to kind of check this one out a little bit more and see where it goes when it gets a little bit further in development or when it comes out as an official game. But this is very very conan-esque uh just in terms of like the feel of it the building is super smooth uh, a little more grounded and oh no grounded and realistic what was that oh oh why am i getting attacked by these guys no oh no i think we're bleeding to death too okay where are they at oh oh there's blood everywhere okay Woo. There's a good chance we're dying right now. Okay. There you go. Got a whole bunch of fresh meat. Oh, a little bit of lag there. Don't lag me. Wow. Oh, it's a person. It's a person. Who is this? Rescue. I'm rescuing you. There you go. Oh. Come on, kill this dude. Okay, the combat, a little bit, a little bit strange. I have no stamps, so like hitting this guy is impossible. No! Okay, well we tried to rescue that person, there was more hyenas. We're so close to base. <laughs> there you go, first death. That's a perfect way to end it. <laughs> kind of the way that we do all of our games, we die kind of quickly. So the campfire, can I not respawn there? I, yes, I can. Bonfire. Revive. And it should spawn me right there. We won't be very far from our stuff. It looks like we do drop everything. We're just 150 meters from our stuff. I could run over there, grab it again, and then maybe hammer those guys one more time. I don't see, like, a chat in-game. Is there a chat? Oh, there is. 
There is. Uh, is that is that the person that I tried to help? <laughs> I think it is. There we go. All right, I'm gonna grab my bag. We're gonna run back. Luckily, we weren't very far from here. <laughs> All right, hold on, I'm almost there. I know, I know. Breathing super hard. Uh, take all. Withdraw all. Okay. Where is that hyena? I will smash the hyena again. Oh, there he is. Okay, I'm having a little bit of trouble. There we go. So you can block, okay? There you go. Okay, so block. Block is good. Ow. <laughs> oh, he got us again. Oh. I will have my revenge, little hyena guy. He's eating well today. All right, we got him back. Take that. <laughs> there you go. We're going to eat well today. And I think that gave us the hide that we needed so we can actually make a water bottle. Absolutely awesome. I think my base is this way. I got a little turned around in our mad dash there. There you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to the patrons and YouTube members that make this channel possible. I appreciate you guys more than you know. Oh, we got tribesmen. There's tribesmen in this. That's so cool, man. Uh, experience, Jay. Ah, okay. Those are looks like the people that are on currently. Very cool. Man, anyways, hey, we're, we're out showing it. We got sidetracked. I'll see you guys next one. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate y'all. Uh, I'll definitely play this one a little bit more, man. Later.